guys, I'm Louise and welcome to my channel. So today's video is going to be a really really big September plant haul and I know it's October now and I know I'm uploading it in like the beginning of October but because I've just been so busy this week doing uni and I've got a gig tomorrow, um, here we are um, giving you a September plant haul, like all the plants I bought in September in October so. so I made a list of all the plants that um, I bought in September um, because there's so many I didn't even realize how many I bought and I always log down what plant I bought and when um, just so I know how long I've had it and so the first plant that I am gonna show you is my Mandula pothos um, Plant. So these actually came as cuttings and um, they were rooted, um, they work, they did come as two. This one had two um, leaves but the other one died. Um, it's doing alright at the moment, um, hasn't really done much so let's just hope it stays alive. But I've also got this one which has three leaves on it and it looks to be like um, this one right here. I don't know if you can see it. But right here there is, looks like to be another leaf coming out at some point and um, be really exciting. Um, yeah, so it's my Mandula pothos. Um, the next plant I'm going to be showing you is my Monstera alvo rugata. So this plant um, I was really lucky to get and um, I'm really really happy with how um, she's behaved. Um, her, this leaf um, has gotten a bit brown in some places and I had to chop it off but um, I put her in new soil, um, put in bonsai mix and um, yeah this plant is doing so much better now and she has actually brought out a new leaf, well bringing out a new leaf, um, hopefully soon it will grow and unravel but this plant takes so long to um, grow so I'm so excited for to see if this leaf is also um, variegated like either like this one here or like this one here but either one I'm gonna love it anyway. The next plant I'm gonna be showing you is my red striped maranta. So actually I'm gonna show you both marantas um, because I bought two um, different species so I got red striped maranta which is this one and she's bringing out um, not as many leaves as this one though. Um, this is my Maranta Lucanera. Um, this one has been bringing out leaves like pretty much every single week and it's ridiculous. And I've literally just got soil all over the bed. Oops. But anyway, um, yeah, there's so many new new leaves on this plant that it's amazing. Like all these really light lime green leaves are the new ones and it's crazy. She's also tucked in for for the night. So yeah, I got two two Marantas. The last Maranta I want to get is the Lemon and Lime Maranta. So very similar to the Red Stripe one, but instead um, it doesn't have Red Stripes. It has Yellow Stripes or Lime Green Stripes or both. Um, can't particularly remember which one, but I really love those these Marantas. So I'm going to get one more um, at some point. So the next two plants I'm going to be showing you are two of my smaller plants. Um, I've got a Tredoscantia quadricolor. So this um, I got from uh, I got a while ago, and I thought it was a tricolor, um, but it didn't. It wasn't labelled or anything, and I've been saying it's a tricolor for a while. But um, I went and bought a variegated. Well, I went and bought another like. Um, another Tredoscantia and I got scanned for it because basically um, it said to have like really like some of some of the leaves quite dark purple and like white and stuff but literally if I just show you it's just another quadricolor so they're both exactly the same so what I'm going to do with this one is I'm going to um, chop off the really long parts of this and I'm just going to propagate make this plant as full as I can and then I'm gonna sell it because I've already got one and I love this one and this one was a scam and it was only like a fiver which wasn't that bad so I'm not like you know oh uh, yeah 
I'm not too gutted about that um, because I'm just gonna sell it on anyway so because um, I am thinking of selling um, plants so I'm just gonna like propagate a load and then um, pop them and sell them on once they've gotten even big enough or yeah so um that's what's happening with this one so don't always believe the photos online maybe if you don't believe it um you get the seller to definitely get the seller to send you a photo of the plant they're going to be sending to you um because i got scammed and yeah oops so the other small plant i got is my pili peperomioids and this one's doing really really well um it's growing quite large it's got so many new leaves in the middle so i'm actually so excited for it to get bigger but yeah here's these the next plant i have is my skin daptus i really love this plant only because these leaves are so big but i just love like the way like the leaves look they're like they're stunning honestly um she's also to it with the wrong she's also going the wrong way um leaning the wrong way should i say because um i uh oh look we've got a new leaf here it's stuck she's got a new leaf coming right there as you can see um i literally just saw her and it was like tangled up with everything else but yeah um she's tilting to one side because i haven't like spun her around because she sits on like the shelf up here and um i always forget to turn her around she always end up like obviously plants grow towards light so if you don't if they're like sat on the window so you don't spin them around they end up like leaning to one side and i'm going i'm still propagating this plant so i'm going to fill her up like the whole pot up so she's like she's got a lot going on but um she's already got a lot going on with these massive leaves and they're amazing so the next plant i'm going to be showing you is my alocasia poly so you've you've seen you've probably seen most of these um plants in like the videos but um some of these you haven't actually seen at all maybe um i don't actually remember so many plants now um but yeah so this is my alocasia poly she is bringing out a new leaf as you can see there and um i actually cannot wait to see how large this one grows probably not as big as the other ones but these leaves are like massive and the only this is the only new leaf that's popped out since i got her so um yeah i really kind of wait for her to grow large maybe or maybe just keep her like this for a while because i know alocasia can grow like massively large and i do not have the space at the moment so i'm going to keep her like this but absolutely love alocasia and i will do a video on how to care for alocasia because i'm getting so many new leaves and all my other alocasias i've got two others um which you've seen in other videos but yeah i'll do a little video on that for you next plant i'm going to be showing you is my uh, uh, tradescantia zebrina so these are actually cuttings which i got because uh from a plant subscription box um well cutting subscription box not plant one because i i don't think i can cope with a plant subscription box but the cutting subscription box and she's doing really well at the moment she's actually growing like really large um i have taken cuttings from her so this one looks a bit bare but i'm gonna fill her out once she's like um grown enough and i've propagated her enough and filled the pot up even more but yeah this is what i have at the moment but she's doing really well and she's growing pretty fast so um, i'm really happy about that so the next plant i'm going to be showing you is not actually in its pot um because i haven't put it in its pot yet but it's um a uh, philodendron uh, cobra and so this one came as a rooted cutting um but she hasn't got like, much roots on it well not not like didn't have much roots on her before but she's grown she's grown so many like new roots um you can probably see there that i'm actually gonna pot her up she actually is um inside that bit there there's like a um a new leaf or something growing in there so um she's definitely gonna be potted up at least up um just like a few other th other th um the other propagations that need pop pot uh, potting up so um if you want to see a video of me potting up um a few propagations not loads like last video literally like 10 minute video like i think about three need propagate three need potting up 
and um, one propagating. But if you want to see that video, just like give this video a thumbs up. Um, and yeah, so that's our hair. And the last but not least, I haven't shown this one in the video yet, I don't think. I don't think I have. Um, this is my Syngonium Albo Variegata and she's stunning, honestly. So she came with uh, f five leaves. Um, one leaf was already dead and the other leaf was dying um, but they both didn't survive unfortunately but I still got the three three leaves um, that did survive in transit which is like it was in the post for about a month and it came all the way from Thailand so I'm really glad that this um, actually survived as well as it did but yeah these leaves are absolutely stunning um, if you follow me on Instagram then you have seen this plant before and she's also bringing out a new leaf which is absolutely amazing and I actually cannot wait to see if this is variegated or not because it's coming from this leaf which is not variegated so uh, we'll see what happens with that but it looks like on um on here it's growing like a few other leaves as well there's like another one down there if you can see just here poking out there you might be able to see that um but yeah so i'm really happy with her she was like lent over quite a lot but she has um perked up since because she was literally like drooping all the way down like that and it was ridiculous um but if you want to see um how she was before when i got her um go to my instagram it's um lou.plants and uh yeah um the link will be in the description below just so um you can quickly go and find me on Instagram and please go and follow me, follow me there because you'll get so many more notifications um, about my plants and how they're doing and all other different um, news as well. Um, but yeah, because I do have a lot of activity going on on my Instagram page as well as my YouTube channel and you will also get notified about my YouTube, YouTube videos as well um, because I always post once they've been uploaded. Um, but yeah, so that's the end of my video. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Please like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you next video. Bye!